Hello, my lovely Geminis. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Gemini, welcome to your weekly reading. This will be for the second week of September. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Signs for all of you. Take what resonates most, leave what doesn't. As you always know, might be totally your story, might be not. Let's see here, love, what the Oracles has here in the plans for you for this week coming up and what the predictions are for you. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Signs for the Geminis. All right, loves. We have the Starfish Spirit, open to infinite possibilities. The next card we have the Wombat Spirit, be at home. Elephant Spirit, learn from the past. And the last card we have the Pig Spirit, use your mind wisely. And underneath here we have the antelope spirit life is speeding up there's something here start like moving 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 and spirit says don't ignore whatever you need to to do at this time okay be in the present be here and now be at home learn from whatever experiences you had in the past and use that in your favor I feel here there is a Gemini here who has so many possibilities, so much abundance to come forward, different directions, not just from one, but could be used in a wise way. Whatever it's coming right now to you, it's like a blessing and starts to move forward quite fine, quite speedy. And for some of you might feel a little like, oh, why now? Why the things right now? And yes, they come at the right time. As you always know, the universe has its way and will work always, always in your favor. And yes, let's hear what the spirit want to share with you. And we are, we are healing with this energy. Seven of Cups where I need to go, what should I do, which way I should go, which part, north, south, west, east. I feel here you have a lot of questions, but I feel here as well, it's like grab the opportunities. You don't really know what to do here. Because as you always know, yes, being A, a or B, but now there is more. Let's see here what's going on. Sometimes I will pick up the cards as they are coming and jumping because that's strong for you. There is blessings. Seven of Cups. I don't feel here is as much as confusion, but it's kind of like what blessing is best for me. All of them loves. Ace of Cups. For some of you, there is people coming towards you. Potential for love. And one of them could be the one. Queen of Cups. Ten of Wands. Ace of Swords. Ten of Cups. Beautiful energy. There is also something here you quite not see right now. Probably some truth. Some clarity here. It's like you are focusing on something here. It's not quite... For you to see so there is some clarity as well coming towards you for some of you yes comes towards you a water sign what you might go towards a water sign there is ace of cups and ace of swords truth and love nine of cups queen of wands seven of swords king of cups Six of Wands, Justice, Two of Pentacles, Magician, and Two of Swords. I see you refusing to open your heart. I'm not sure what to do, with who to be. I, I have a Leo here, could be an Aries or a Sag as well. I, I have Libra here, but I see you more single right now. You might have fire in a chart. 
but I definitely see here there is somebody here you love and I feel here as well in the next few weeks six of wands is the card which is your timing card it's like in the next six weeks here could be six days six weeks there is some things here you you gotta clear there's something here you you need to do but it's it's kind of I'm refusing to I'm refusing to somebody here needs to let go somebody to be with you or you need to let go somebody to be with that person and to experience that milk and honey ten of cups beautiful energy here definitely I have water fire but I feel here there is something here also a Libra energy here there's something here to leave behind and move forward okay seven of swords here four of wands queen of sword king of swords and ace of pentacles all right loves i feel here you might have a lot of fire here but also i see here who you do love is not quite honest whatever they telling you whatever they give you we have three aces here the ace is missing is ace of wands which is the strongest ace here passion passionate new beginning two of pentacles ten of pentacles i'm not sure if i'll get this or not it's like you you're waiting for a commitment here from somebody and you kind of like it's too long takes so long two of swords you don't see this coming here empress page of swords you are the third party here my loves and six of pentacles one more card ten of cups i feel here you want to put work into here it's like how we can work things here the person who you are connected yes could be a water with fire fire with water but that person with who they are they is not quite great okay for some of you, you are dealing here with the fire sign, but the love between you two is not quite there, the passion. So there is some differences. For some of you, yes, you are in a third party here, and you are the third party here. Okay? And it's like you're waiting, waiting for this person to offer you something, and they will make the moves. They will overcome whatever it is here. They need to overcome a separation with somebody. They need to let go something here absolutely yes and i feel here you will get news from this person it's like something here comes in your favor absolutely yes here he is moving towards a new beginning towards you whoever this person but they might might have some financial problems if they leave somebody here, somebody here will try to, to take their finances, money. There is something here they need to leave behind and it's quite hard for them. It's like the sacrifices here. And I feel here there is blessings. There is blessing coming here. One more card here. Yes, I feel here this person, if they hold back to let go somebody or they hold back or took time, put you to wait here. Now it's kind of like, you know, I will take action towards whatever I want because I want to be with you. But there is still some worry around the financial field here. You really manifest this person to come towards you, whoever they are, water or fire, strongly here. For some of you, it could be a Libra 
what a Taurus. But that's what I get here. A lot of fire, a lot of water. There's no earth as as here as we see, but I do see here. For some of you it could be another air sign, but I see here strongly water and air. It's like this person they leaving somebody but they've been scared about their finances strongly but now they feel like you know how much you can take how much miserable i can stay here wherever i am whatever they've been was very very you know dark you might feel like you know i've been patient enough but now I don't see them coming towards you. I don't see them coming and wanting to be happy. It's like somebody here might even thought like they will never be happy or they don't deserve to be happy. For some of you, you question like why? Why you cannot be happy? Because you absolutely can. And I feel here there is something here could be you could be them there's something here the past here is like stepping out for what you truly believe and then move forward for some of you being in this situation in this third party could be convenient for a period of time but then you feel like that you know i want more for myself I want something better. Yes, that was at first in and out energy. But now it's kind of like, you know, I want something stable. I want something which is mine. So now you have it, loves. Now you have it. Let's see here, one advice. Tower, the time is now. Whatever been will not be. It's kind of whatever was before that's not going to happen anymore. And for those of you who have been single for quite a while here, you'll not be single for too long because this person comes. And here he is. Cancerian energy. The chariot. Life is speeding up. Yes, it is. There is movement forward fast. Yes, it is. Let it shine, my lovely Geminis. Here you are. Definitely here, there are blessings. For some of you, you might feel like, you know, this never will come with this Two of Swords. I couldn't believe this. I still keep an eye, I still keep an eye, but here it is. This is your happy ever after energy. All right, Gemini, beautiful reading for you. And here you are. Thank you so much for watching, being here on the channel. Love and light to all of you. See you next time. Namaste.